Discover a land of sensations, of sounds, of people. Este es un país de contrastes. Discover a country that is changing. Colombia is living in a very special moment in its history. And we are now in a new era in Colombia. There are new destinations, especially nature destinations in Colombia, that are opening to tourism worldwide. Discover a world of diversity and creativity. Discover Colombia. On the northern side of the country, where the Magdalena River flows into the Caribbean, Atlantico is emerging as a growing region, both culturally and economically. Nosotros tenemos un rol fundamental que jugar en la expansión económica, en el desarrollo económico, no solamente de nuestra gente, sino también de una colaboración para tratar de que la cuenca del Caribe sea un sector de progreso cada vez mayor. As the capital of the region, Barranquilla is the center of this transformation. With its new slogan, Capital de Vida, it's preparing for a grand debut. Mega infrastructure projects, including the Gran Malecón, an urban esplanade that will improve the riverside, are changing the face of the city. Son cinco kilómetros de malecón, de zonas peatonales, de zonas culturales, de ciclorrutas, de mucha zona verde, de zonas deportivas, de zonas comerciales, y a su vez un cinturón vial. Ya queremos que la gente viva frente al río, contemple el río, disfrute su río, y pueda, pues, por supuesto, generarle mucho más valor. A nuestra ciudad. Work is underway to make the city even more attractive. 120 parks are undergoing important restorations. Carnaval, known as the happiest carnival in the world, is the third largest worldwide and draws over half a million visitors every year. Meanwhile, Puerta de Oro, the country's second largest exposition center, complements the city's strengths as a cultural and business center. La ciudad acoge primero por el carisma de los barranquilleros, la coge, la abraza y le dice, ¿por qué no te vienes a vivir a Barranquilla? Hub of services of industry and commerce, but also a hub of culinary experiences and hotel and tourism sectors. Its strategic location Port infrastructure and talented workforce make Barranquilla a unique place to live and an exciting place to do business. Home to several multinational companies, Barranquilla has played a key role in the success of ProCaps, one of the country's largest pharmaceutical producers. We feel that the, our biggest contribution to the city, in addition to creating sustainable jobs, is that we have hope that we will be an inspiration for companies of this medium size that they can dream big, that they can really reach out and be an international force worldwide. This rapidly changing city, an economic and touristic hub, also aims to become a regional center for sport, hosting the 23rd Central American and Caribbean Games with thousands of athletes of 37 different countries.
estamos construyendo nuevos escenarios deportivos en nuestra ciudad. Eso va a posicionar a Barranquilla, digamos, en el entorno mundial del deporte. The games begin on July 19th, 2018. Todas esas cosas en conjunto con nuestra apuesta del río, nuestra apuesta de Barranquilla Verde, nuestra apuesta de sistema de transporte masivo, ambientalmente sostenible, están haciendo de esta ciudad una ciudad diferente. East of Atlantico's hustle and bustle lies the department of Magdalena. Of its many agro-industrial producers, Magdalena boasts the presence of Darbon a leader in sustainable palm production, both nationwide and worldwide. We have a very high production of palm oil, which represents about 40,000 hectares of the northern Rock coast of Colombia. And today, Davon Group represents one of the largest conglomerates of agro-industry in Colombia around the palm oil activities. To bring the best products to market, The company focuses on environmental responsibility, partnerships with surrounding communities, and corporate integrity. Darbon is also the largest shareholder in the maritime port of Santa Marta, the only multi-purpose deep water terminal in Colombia, as well as the only port on the Atlantic coast serviced by a rail infrastructure that allows for cargo to be loaded and unloaded directly on the banks. Santa Marta is also rich in history and culture as the first post-Columbian city founded in South America in 1525. Santa Marta, la ciudad más antigua de Sudamérica, ha sido, como muchos municipios del Magdalena, la cuna de reconocidos talentos destacados a nivel nacional e internacional. Formed by numerous basins, the region sustains wild beauty and high biodiversity. The largest water basin is the Cienega Grande de Santa Marta. The Salamanca Island Road Park is home to one of the world's richest variety of birds, many indigenous to Colombia. Tairona National Park is an unspoiled destination for travelers looking for unforgettable experiences. In the Sierra Nevada, are some of the country's oldest inhabitants, the Kogis, in villages that take you back in time. Aracataca, the birthplace of famous writer Gabriel García Márquez, is the first stop on the legendary Macondo route, which takes you on a fabulous journey to the magical places that inspired the author. Moving east to the northernmost stretch of Colombia is La Guajira, a magical land of contrasts. La Guajira is a region singular in Colombia. It's the first region in which los explorers europeos take contact with the country as a whole in 1499. An explosion of colors and sensations, of always changing impressive landscapes, of wild beaches, lunar salt mines, red dunes, infinite deserts, and green rivers. It's no surprise that Marcus's writing was inspired by this land of dreams. Él se crió en la casa con la cocina de la Guajira, con la religiosidad de la Guajira. Venir a la Guajira es encontrar de pronto esa magia de Gabriel García Márquez que encuentran ustedes en su obra. La Guajira is also the ancestral home of the Wayus, the indigenous community guardians of these desolate territories and gifted craftsmen. Many composers of Vallenato folk music also found their romantic inspiration in this unique land. Magia, pasión y orgullo. Con esas tres palabras decimos que es la Guajira. On the western side of Colombia, Valle del Cauca faces the Pacific Ocean and is one of the most important regions in the country. The region is blessed with exotic landscapes and home to cheerful people. Its capital, Santiago de Cali, is recognized worldwide for salsa dancing. On the northern edge of Valle del Cauca lies Buenaventura, a timeless land where crashing waves meet the jungle 
and flowing rivers form fishing islands. With the objective of developing Buenaventura socially and economically, the government is reinventing the city with projects that will increase employment and transform the urban and industrial landscape. Sociedad Portuaria de Buenaventura is the number one port terminal in Colombia. Thanks to its new transfer service, Eurosal, it can now concentrate Europe-bound cargoes from Guayaquil and Paita, as well as serve the South American Pacific coastline with greater efficiency and fewer costs. The terminal Sociedad Portuaria has invested in its 23 years cerca de 800 millones de dólares en equipamiento portuario, sistema de información, seguridad. Thanks to these improvements and to the natural tide in the bay, the port can moor ships over 370 meters long and with nominal capacities of up to 13,000 TEUs. But more importantly, Sociedad Portuaria de Buenaventura has recently impacted the lives of 2,153 students who intended to get into higher education. Nos sentimos orgullosos de haberle facilitado estudio universitario a más de 300 jóvenes de la región, de los cuales el 80% están laborando. But Sociedad Portuaria de Buenaventura is not alone in its mission. Another key contributor of the region is Smurfit Kappa, a pioneer in the packaging business. It's also a forerunner in sustainability. In fact, it's responsible for introducing recycling, reforestation, and most importantly, supporting early childhood education. We have a foundation that has been more than 50 years. As we were investing in the forest area, we wanted to help those areas that didn't have a very high development. Smurfit Kappa Sociedad Portuaria de Buenaventura and many others have supported education because a nation with strong foundations relies on well-educated individuals. The institution that has longest believed in this is the Pontificia Universidad Javeriana, a leader in research, teaching and community service for four centuries. With campuses in the cities of Bogotá and Cali, it aims to be a model recognized locally and globally for its contributions to society, creating an environment of academic excellence, internationalization and human ecology, encouraging reconciliation in Colombia. Its activities ensure the sustainable development of its campuses and the well-being of its educational community of more than 38,000. Javeriana for progress and change, promoting not only the best in the world, but also the best for the world. In response to the growing number of investors and professionals visiting Colombia, the hospitality sector is booming. The Dan Hotels now rank among the top business hotel chains in the country. The recently remodeled Casa Dan Carlton Hotel and Spa is a cornerstone of hospitality for professionals and tourists looking for the best service and convenient location while visiting vibrant Bogotá. Its properties across the country are known for luxury, comfort and exclusive dining, leaving guests with unforgettable memories. For business or pleasure, get to know Colombia through a place you'll never want to leave. Through radical and positive changes, Colombia has united five regions and emerged as a strong nation. Colombia is the land of thousands of countries. It has opened its doors to the world and mesmerized it with its love for diversity and culture. The time to come to Colombia is now to discover that new, larger country that has so much to offer to the world and that is willing to embrace people from all nationalities. All eyes are on Colombia.